Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another episode of Tinkercad TV. So let's get cracking. Now, friends, the goal of every episode of Tinkercad TV is to entertain and inspire. Today's design is no exception, so let me show you what we got. Friends, today's wicked cool design comes from Canopsia. It is Backrooms Entity 34 Doll Faces. Real quickly, I'm going to shut off the notes. I also like to click on the settings. Let's give it a different background. I'm going to go with the tan, and then I also like to shut off the grid. Gives us a much better view when we're checking out this wicked cool creation. Now I have not followed backrooms, but I did some looking. I find it so cool that one user shared a little bit of content and then all of a sudden we end up with a community based horror universe that anybody can add to. It's also cool that there are five versions of the backroom universe, each with its own different levels and creatures. This doll face is part of the Wikidots version of the backrooms, and it's just a plush creature that you can also tame and befriend. That it's created by people like us. I also find it wicked cool that we can use Tinkercad to create our own fan art. So real quickly, let's turn on those notes and let's see just what was added. So first, doll faces are plush-like entities that can be found in large groups around the back rooms. Groups of doll faces are known to attack wanderers. If you find one singular doll face in one of the levels, you are able to tame it by giving it almond water. How cool is that? The face was based off an old dummies and Coraline plush from the movie Coraline. The hair is made out of a sphere and a bunch of cones that I turned into a hole and then I just group them and copy and paste the group shape. We're going to take that apart and check it out in just a minute. And then also back in the back, we have got a tag. And then one other fun feature, the back is ripped. Love all the little stitches. Oh my gosh, this dude is so incredible. We'll shut off the notes just for one quick view. Let's see what we can do with this hair. Oh, it is still separate. So if I do Control D, let me shift nudge that out there. And you can see that that is a sphere. And then when we ungroup it, you can see all the cones that are randomly put in there to make the hair piece. And then a bunch of these put together turn into that wicked cool hair. What a sweet technique. Love when I can easily show you how things were created in the projects. Friends, as an added bonus, if you check the properties of this video, you'll be able to see all of the awesome designs that Canopsia has created. Of course, if you check them out, make sure you give them a reaction. And of course, Canopsia, thank you so much for sharing your wicked cool creations with us. Friends, I just want to take a moment to remind you that if you ever make something awesome, like say you complete one of my tutorials, or you've just made something you dig, you can take a moment to share your creation with me so I can check it out by simply clicking this button, generate a link, copy that link, and then you can reach out and share it with me. I am HL Mod Tech on Facebook, Instagram, Gmail, and TikTok. You can also find me on Twitter. I am I am HL Tinkercad. If those options don't work for you, don't forget you can also visit my website, hlmodtech.com. I've got the page dedicated to Tinkercad with tons of amazing lessons. You can find the day one favorites. You can also find useful starters, the Tinkercad essentials, and then down here is a sweet built-in message until you can click that button, add your question, comment, suggestion, or share link, and reach me almost instantly. Friends, I do want to remind you about the link to the Tinkercad community discord as you can see we've got more than 800 members and it's a fantastic place to talk everything tinkercad finally friends as we wrap up this episode of tinkercad tv i just want to say thanks again to canopsia for sharing your wicked cool backroom projects so cool to see something totally different in tinkercad and you're taking it to such epic levels and of course friends if you enjoyed the video please give it a like 
please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button. And last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.